And thank you. No problem. Already getting hot. Good morning. I'm already halfway done with my coffee. <laughs> I uh, am going to have a shopping video for you guys today. If you're new here, welcome. I'm Melissa, and thank you for joining me if you're coming back to another video. I appreciate you guys. And I just pulled up at a Home Depot. We're going to stop in here first, and then we're going to go to Herb Creek. It's like a mile down the road. It's a garden center, and they have some rare plants and some other house plants. And then we'll see where the day leads us, where else I want to go after Herb Creek. I might go to another place or two but we'll see uh, this Home Depot I haven't been to in a little while it's a little bit further out for me so I don't really come down this way I'm looking for agave specifically at this Home Depot and of course a variegated Maranta how could I not uh, my radar is going to be going off for uh, a variegated Maranta I just I feel like I'm gonna find some soon I need to check out a Walmart really because that's where I found my variegated Maranta so I'm gonna see if there's any like good Walmarts around. I might stop in a couple of those. We'll see. <laughs> so we're going to go in this Home Depot first, see what they have, and then I will take you to Herb Creek next, and then we'll see where the day leads us. All right, the outside section, I immediately saw Maranta, and I thought it was a variegated one. They should be $19.99, I imagine. They have one more here, and there's one more here. Oh, actually, there's one more here, too. They have four red Marantas. What else do they have hanging up? Look at that pretty Tradescantia. I think that's a purple heart. Maybe. Or burgundy. The color's pretty. Look at that. In the sunlight, isn't that pretty? They have a little... Uh, lipstick plant here. These pots are either really heavy or I'm just weak. <laughs> uh, let's see. They have some rabbit foot ferns here. And there's some Sangonium. Uh, those are $15.98. Ooh, what is this? This looks variegated. It is a variegated lipstick plant. Oh, that's cool. Do you see that? That's so cute. There's another variegated one here too. These are only $15.98. They're pretty. Here's a Fatonia. This one is $15.98 as well. Lots of big plants here. Ficus, fiddles, there's peace lilies, monsteras, so many. The sun is coming in too. <laughs> uh, look at all these ZZ plants. Whoa. Lots of ferns on the back side here. Lots of monsteras. Those guys are 26. Cute little ponytail palms. Oh wow, look at these huge syndapsis baskets. Oh gosh, that's heavy. Whoa, look at this thing. It is huge. That is a big basket, you guys. It is only $19.98. This looks like the Argyreus. That is amazing. So they have that one. They have another one here, and then one more here on the end. That has to be an eight inch pot, or a 10 inch actually. Those are huge pots. More big plants, money trees, dracaenas, palms. Those guys are huge. Look at that trunk on that one. 
for 39. They're pretty though. Looks like just Aglionemas and the Calatheas here in the middle. This one's so pretty. I love the pink star. I don't have the pink star. <laughs> Maybe one day. Here's another little in cab. It looks like more Aglionema and Diffenbachias. And there's some orchids up top here. So pretty. I already glanced through all the small plants. I didn't see any Maranta, which was kind of sad, but that's okay. They have these Syndapsis baskets here. They're only $14.98 um, from Vigro. But look how cute they are. Another Argyreus. There's several of them here. I feel like that's a really good deal, $15. They feel, they seem like they're a nice full like healthy basket. Uh, didn't really see too much else in the small plants. Here's some golden little fiddles, some aglionema, lots of palms and zizis. This one's reverting to the Rojo Congo. Look at that leaf on that one. That's so cool. I love seeing that mutation happen. I just think it's so cool. Well, it is over here. Got some Raven's Easies. And here is a chameleon, maybe? Yeah, that's a chameleon. See the color. Some Adansonii, this uh, Xanthosoma. We have lots of Syndapsis trubii moonlights and uh, some silver dragon alocasias. Sometimes I can spot some like random leaves that have variegation. I don't see anything though. Some global greens, Raphidophora hayis, and then some peperomia here too. And those kind of go all the way back. There's some Monstera Peru in here as well. Here's another end cap. We have some Raven Zizis in the middle. I was just like looking at these huge baskets. $79.98. Looks like you have a couple plants and an orchid. This one has a Monstera Peru. That's interesting. And a couple bromeliads and it looks like two orchids. This looks like the lemon meringue. That's interesting that that's in the pot with the orchid here. And you have two red anthurium and one orchid. And we have these down here on the bottom. These are a, uh, that's the name of it there. I saw these in a store before. They're pretty. Huge fiddle here for 99. Got two of them. Lots more orchids here. Oh wow, are they only $10? Orchid was $15.98, now only $10. These orchids are only $10? There's so many of them. It's now my chance to get an orchid if they're only $10. I feel like that's such a great deal. Normally the orchids are like 30, 25 plus dollars. I don't know you guys, $10 is a good deal. Looks like we have lots of pink ones, some yellow, white. Uh, trying to see if there's any unique ones. That one's kind of pretty with that color there. Hmm, it is very tempting. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna have to think about that if I don't forget. All right, before I go back down there and see what's down there, I'm gonna head inside real quick and see if there's any plants. And yeah, I'm curious. I don't know if there's anything in there or not, but we will see. Wow, you guys, we hit the plant jackpot in here. Look at all these plants. They don't have all the lights on. It's pretty dark in here. Uh, so I'm gonna try and show you if my camera will pick it up. Oh, wow. 
the lights magically turned on. That's so funny. Look at all these plants. Whoa. So this is the Leaf Joy. They had these at the other Home Depot. Let's see if there's anything here. Some of them don't look the happiest. So many. Gosh, we have rubber trees, Rojo Congos, Adansonii, we got Calatheas. This is the um, like fuzzy one. We have the lemon lime philodendron, some tenanthi. What is going on with their lights? <laughs> Lots of burgundies on the bottom. We have uh, more rubber trees on the bottom. There's the alocasia. They're kind of squished in here. All right, let's see what Costa has over here. I see some pink princesses. Here's um, a white knight too. Pink princess. Uh, let's see. Oh, here's some more pink princesses. They're more like burgundy princesses though. There's not a lot of pink on those ones. Here's some Silver Streak uh, Pothos. Epipremnum Amplissimum is the other name for it. Let's see, what else? It's kind of some more of the same. Here's some more pink princesses. We have quite a bit up here. Yeah, those are more like a burgundy. Yeah, my camera's not liking how dark it is. <laughs> Just kind of more the same. All of the pink princesses don't have much color on them. Here's another cart by Costa. We have some begonia maculatas. Some raven zizis. We got some more of the Xanthosoma here. And lots more silver dragons. These leaves are pretty huge on these guys. Not really seeing anything variegated. <laughs> and there's another little section here, some hanging baskets and some smaller plants and larger plants. Oh wow, these fiddles are only 69. Was 99. So you get these huge fiddly fig trees for $70. That is amazing. I feel like that's such a good deal. And then you have these huge peace lilies on sale for $49 from $69. And they're huge, you guys. Yeah, I think that's pretty much it for in here. Just some good deals like on some larger plants, I feel like. If you've been wanting to snag one of those. All right, I wanna head back out and see what else I can find out there. I'm back outside. I spotted some agave there on the bottom. I'm gonna go get a couple of those. All the succulents and stuff is very squished back here. I'll try and show you what I can. And then I browsed around this section. I didn't see too much, honestly. They have this huge golden pothos totem. Look at that. It is, how much is this guy? 139. But it is huge and massive. Look at that. So pretty. I think I'm going to do a golden on a pole just because I think that yellow, once it gets bigger, is beautiful. Uh, they have some caladiums here, but I'm not going to get any because it's, you know, kind of heading towards September and they're going to start going dormant. And they have some like Tratoscantia and Pothos hanging. I'll show you those. And they have some like bigger plants, like Monstera, snake plants, Alocasia back there that I'll show you. But I'm gonna snag these agave before uh, someone swipes them. I have a feeling they're gonna be more expensive at the other plant shop. And these are ones that I was wanting. Oh, I love this color. Look at that, you guys. Ugh. Wow. This is a 
Uh, agave Americana Variegata Matsumoto? Matsumoto? <laughs> I have no idea. That is cool. Look at that. I just love that color. I don't know if you can tell. It's like a, a yellow margin border. They're kind of expensive. These are $39 each, but they do so well. And this is kind of another one I was wanting. Okay, I'm gonna have to lift this with two hands. Uh, this one's just a plain color. This one is just a Gave Americana. So that's just the regular kind. I don't know much about agave. I just know that they do so well out front in the full sun. Um, but this one's like a just all green blue color, whereas this one has the trim, the yellow margin. And the ones that we have out front already, we have two that we got here and they're growing so well. They look like this one is what we have already. I don't forget, I'll have to show you them. This is just the Agave Americana Variegata. I don't know, it definitely looks different. It's like thinner, whereas these are thicker. I'm happy with those. I think those are gonna look beautiful, especially once they start growing. There's another one here of the yellow margin, but it's a lot smaller. I'm gonna, I think I'm just gonna get those two. Here's some more of what we have already. Ow, oh, spiky things. I think these are kind of cool too. This one's a little bit taller. So that one's more like a spiky bush. <laughs> that is very pretty though. Yucca filamentosa variegata. I'm gonna have to think on that. I sort of want to get one. But over here, we just have so many succulent arrangements and stuff. They're kind of just all over the place, honestly. I did see a string of pearls. Uh, where did it go? I think it's on the other side. They have some big planters here. I think those are 40 and they have more of them kind of on that side. I can't really get over there. And lots of beautiful arrangements over here. Lots of various succulents here. This one's kind of cute with that variegated cacti there. Here's the string of pearls. Doesn't look very full though. It is only $11.98, $12. It's not too bad. We have some smaller hanging baskets here. No dolphins though. I still want a dolphins. I think these ones are very pretty. They're 25, you get a ton of succulents in there. There's some single ones here. And my camera is getting very angry that it's hot out here. I ended up getting one of these other yuccas, so that one looked pretty healthy. So I'm gonna go home with these three, I know. Um, I'm gonna go browse the other section. I saw some more various arrangements here out front. These are 30 as well. Look at the color on that succulent. That is beautiful. That orangey tone, $25. That is actually very beautiful. I love that color. Oh gosh. You get like a flapjack in there, several succulents. That color is everything for fall. That is so beautiful. Wow, look at those. That is so cool. That is a neat succulent. 
These are all like so pretty. $25. I'll be tempted to get one of these for my porch. So beautiful, all of them. There's some big cacti over here, prickly pears. They are $19.98. And we have some Madagascar palms. Here's some aloe. Some huge aloes, look at that guy. <laughs> it's huge for only $26.98. These huge baskets of them. That is crazy. We have some little spider plant baskets. Well, I should say big. <laughs> Look at those. They're only $16.98. Look at how pretty that is. See that color? They're very white. I didn't realize spider plants were this white looking. And there's actually a lot more hanging up that I didn't notice. $17, they're very pretty. And then around the back side, they had a lot of pothos. It looks like probably just golden. They're very huge baskets. Some more Tradescantia here, very full. Look at that, so pretty. $30. This one's like a combo. And then we have some that are in smaller baskets for $16.98. So pretty. Oh wow, and then they have even smaller baskets for $8, purple zebra. Gorgeous. The amount of big plants out here is crazy. There's so many. A lot of like outdoor plants mixed in with indoor plants. Look at all these monsteras. They're only $19.98. They look very happy. That's such a good deal for a cute Monstera Deliciosa, $20. I put one of these philodendron in my cart here. I'm gonna, we're gonna do this one in the yard because I've seen these really big and they're so beautiful. Uh, they got reclassified, I always forget the name of it, but I'll definitely put it on the screen. They're only at $19.98. Um, and there's several of them. And they have some huge alocasias. They have the California, and then they have the, I believe that is a Wintii. Yeah, that looks like the Wintii. They're huge. For only $19.98. I'll probably get these, or one of these, to plant in the yard for uh, spring next year, summer. Um, I might just do the caladiums though, that way I can store the balls. Uh, they're very pretty. Look how huge they are. <laughs> very gorgeous. And there's lots more monsteras and snake plants and alocasias. You name it. There's so many of them. Oh, here's some more agave. Oh, well, here's a random marble queen down here too. Look at that. It's a huge basket. Some more arrangements. This has a little uh, brick rack cactus. Is that what you call that in this one? All right, I think I am going to try and decide if I'm going to get an orchid for $10. Uh, these don't count as plants since they're all being planted out in our yard. Um, I think this is everything that we wanted for the yard, at least for right now, <laughs> and probably until next year. We just wanted to get some more agave planted. So yeah, I will meet you back in my car and we'll move on to our next place here. I'm starting to sweat now. It is getting very hot. It's starting to cloud up though, so maybe it'll rain and cool things off. I'm definitely gonna go to Herb Creek next and we'll see how I feel after that. I might try and find a Walmart. Uh, I did come home with an orchid. 
I couldn't pass it up. I've been wanting an orchid, and I feel like for $10, how could I not get an orchid for $10? I liked the pink color on this one. Isn't that pretty? It's just a Phalan Phalaenopsis orchid, and they look very healthy and happy, like their root system and everything. Uh, yeah, so I'm very excited to have one. I'll probably, um, I don't know where I'm going to put it or anything. <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't know. I just couldn't pass up a $10 orchid. So yeah, if you're looking for orchids, stock up. Look at how beautiful. I'm going to seatbelt her in the car so I, I don't drop her around. And then I put all my other plants in my trunk. So I have the two agave, the yucca, and then the philodendron or the theo, whatever it is. <laughs> We're going to plant those in the yard. So the only plant that I got technically is an orchid. <laughs> uh, yeah, so the Air Creek is like a mile up the road. I'm going to head there and cool off a minute and we'll do some more plant shopping. I just pulled up at Herb Creek behind me. I was going to look around outside a little. I, I guess I don't need any agave because I got them at Home Depot. I don't think there would be anything out here that I would want, but I might take a look around. But I'm going to head inside first where it's air conditioning and just see what they have. I'm not going to buy anything. I'm not going to buy anything. Beautiful. That is gorgeous. They have some of these yuccas over here too. That color is very pretty. This is just a color guard yucca. This one has a big bloom coming off of it. That's so cool. So interesting. I'm gonna head inside here and see what kind of house plants they have. Once you walk in on the inside, they have this little cart here with more rare plants. And I saw this, I was not sure what it was. It said it was a mandula. I've never seen a mandula pothos that looked like this. It had a whopping price tag though. Um, are mandulas becoming more rare? Because I thought that was very expensive. You can get a mandula for $5 at a big box store. And they had a couple of Thai Constellation Monsteras. They were so stinking cute. I feel like 119 was reasonable because they used to be so much more expensive. And they had some white knights here. These were $29.99. They were so cute. And then they also had some pink princesses. They had this one for $59. It was a little bit bigger. And they had a few of these smaller sizes. These guys um, had some good color. They were $49.99, yes. So definitely, um, you know, I've been seeing those pop up at the big box store too. This was a McDowell for $39. Those guys can get huge. And then I saw these Ring of Fires. Look at that leaf. I saw that leaf and I'm like, oh no, the wheels are turning in my head. I'm like, $49, look at that variegation. Is it gonna come home with me? They had a lot of them here, you guys. They had a lot. <laughs> and then some various other plants there on the bottom. This car, I was just kind of looking around. They had some various plants, Calathea, Philodendron, Dracaena, Monstera, all kinds of stuff. I love just like coming in here and just looking around. They had these here, um, I'm trying to remember the name of them, maybe a fishbone cactus, I think that's what they're called, uh, $29.99, they were kind of cute, and then moving along on this side, just some various plants, a Monstera deliciosa, some pothos, syngonium, uh, some ficus, they have this golden pothos on like a totem. There's a philodendron here. And then moving along, I was blown away with the size of some of these plants. This begonia was huge. I love that dark red on the back side. And they had this syngonium tower. They had a couple of them. I think this is the El Cardi red or something like that. They have the red backs. 
and um, I love that pot here. I was checking <laughs> to see how much it was. I think it was like 20 some dollars, so a little bit too much for me that I wanted to spend, but it was so cute. And what else was here? They had this cute little uh, zebra plant up there that I'll show you too. This was labeled as a begonia, but it looks like a Cissus discolor. Is that what it looks like to you guys? Uh, it was 22. They were very pretty though. I love that pop of color. And then up top here is the zebra plant. It caught my eye because it had a cute little bloom. Oh, and that was a skeleton key. The person here at the store was telling me that she just got those in. She had a few of them. And I don't really know much about skeleton keys, so. I guess they have this cool uh, shape as they mature. And then on this section, just some various kind of more common plants. They had a pilea here, lots of ferns, uh, some peperomias. There was actually quite a bit of hoyas here too. They had some here, and then they also had some larger ones hanging up um, and hanging baskets. I just love looking at all the different plants here. And look at the micans. Holy cow! They had a lot more hanging up too. And this sun changing begonia was so pretty uh, with that sun coming in through the window. Gorgeous. They had some alocasia tiny dancers. I was like, I was looking for a variegated maranta, and then I found some maranta, and I'm like, ooh, let me check. Uh, but they were just lemon lime here. No variegated Kershiovanas. Uh, these were $11.99. And then up top they had a couple red marantas. Rattlesnake Calathea. There's the red ones. And what else was here? This section on the back, they had this tower filled with different kinds of ferns. They had lots of staghorn ferns in here. Rabbit foot ferns. They had some more syngonium back here. And then they had these pitcher plants. They had a lot more um, hanging up. Uh, they were so cool. I've never really seen like a big one in person before. They had the silver sword philodendron on this core pole. I think those were 30 or 35, something like that. Some more Calathea. They had these like neon lemon lime philodendrons. The color was so pretty on those. All right, I just got back in my car again. I walked a little bit more around out here, but there wasn't really a whole lot out, just a lot of outdoor stuff. So inside, you saw me looking at the rare section. They had a lot of stuff. I was like so hoping for a variegated Miranda. Look, I ended up getting the Ring of Fire. You guys, what's wrong with me? I don't need any more plants. It was $49.99. I remember when Ring of Fires used to be like $200 for just a tiny cutting. Does anyone remember those days? Uh, 
why do I do this to myself? Why? I just felt like I couldn't pass it up for 49. I used to want one for back. I used to want one of these a long time ago back in the day. And I'm just like, if I ever came across one, I would be tempted to get it. I don't know. That leaf did it to me, that leaf right there, because I'm a sucker for variegation. <laughs> uh, yes, I got it. I don't know what's wrong with me, like I said. I just don't know where I'm going to put these plants. <laughs> and I did end up getting the agave too, so I have another agave back there to put in the yard. Um, so yeah, we, I'm not buying anything else. I might be tempted to stop in a Walmart just to peek. If I do, I'll take you along. Um, I'll see. I kind of, it's still kind of early. It's just now hitting 11 o'clock, so I'll probably stop one other location. But yeah, I'm not buying anything else unless it's a variegated Maranta. Nothing else is coming home with me. <laughs> Ooh, they have more of my watering cans. This is my favorite watering can. This is where I got mine. It's only eight dollars. See what they have. I imagine they're probably gonna be marking this stuff down for fall. One of these terrariums. what all is left here. Still have a lot of ceramics. All right, let's see what plants are here. at these guys. They are 25. That's pretty. Mm. That's some Calatheus. Some pretty Birkins. Look at the color on that one. That's pretty. And Monstera Peru's, wow, look at the leaves on that. Some of them are dark. I wonder if that's just new growth. It's so light compared to some of the darker leaves. Some Aglionema, some Zizis. This cute Syngonium basket, look how cute that is. It is 1984. Some little Tradescantia here and a Photonia. Lots of little succulents. These guys are cute. They are $6.96. Some Euphorbia for $19.96. Those are so cool. Have some more cactus for $19.96. And then we have some little hanging plants here. These are only 15. Little Dracaenas. Couple Raphidophora hay eyes here. Some larger plants. Not a whole lot here. We got some sago palms, dracaenas, ponytail palms, lots and lots of cacti. Look at all of these guys. <laughs> and we have some larger ones here. Holy. They're so big.
And then behind me, it looks like we have some begonia maculatas. They're really thirsty, they want some water. There's some Baltic blue here. Lots of those, and those guys on the end are thirsty too. We got more aglionemas, raven's easy, snake plants. We got some, a couple monsteras here. They're 24.84. And we got some fiddles and peace lilies. I don't see any small plants though. Wow, those guys really want water too. Poor things. Some orchids. Yeah, that's pretty much it here. I mean, overall, they're not in bad shape. There's a couple thirsty plants, but still have a nice little selection. No way! It's a dolphins! I've been looking forever for dolphins! How much are these? $11 maybe? Oh, how cute! There's two of them. I don't know how much they are though. Oh, $8. It was meant to be, you guys, to find dolphins. Should I get both of them or just one? I wonder. I feel like if I get one, it'll fill the pot out. Or if I get two. That is so funny. I'm gonna get the more compact one because uh, I like this guy like this. I really wasn't planning on buying a ton of plants today. They have a cute little burrow's tail too. Uh, what else is here? Succulent wise. This one's cool. This agave. That's some big plants over here. And money trees are falling over. Some big ZZs for 30. This is so cute. I literally was not even going to stop in a Lowe's. Look at these big Wint TI for 26. Some Monsteras. Let's see. We got over here. Got some Baltic blue. No, these are Raphidophora tetrasperma. Tiny little Calatheas. Oh, what are you? You look different. It's a philodendron, but what kind of philodendron are you? Ooh. What kind of philodendron are you? I don't have you. There's another one. Kind of reminds me of a philodendron tanu, baby, tanu, but I don't, I don't know. That's a cool find. It's only thirteen ninety eight. I'm intrigued. I am intrigued by that one. I don't need another philodendron though. It definitely looks like a tanu. I used to have one. We got some ficus, we got some cute black velvets here. Hmm. I'm gonna have to think on that. <laughs> uh, we got some bigger hanging baskets, more of the same at this location. 
All right, let's see what they have inside because that's where the good stuff is hiding. Really trying to see if I could spot any. <laughs> no luck, you guys. Not pretty syngonium. Uh, no Maranta. What's over here? Look at these huge photonias. They are massive. I got some lemon limes uh, there in the back. Wow, these things are huge. We got like a smaller form and then ones that have like really large leaves. Uh, I got some lemon meringues here. Tons of calathea. Kind of just more of the same. Let's see. These little space guys. <laughs> uh, that's so funny. What are you looking for? Here's that spathosoma there. It's a cute golden, very yellow and vibrant. We got a beautiful marble queen here. Um, a syndapsis. Oh wow, look at this one. This looks like an exotica. That's very beautiful. These pots are $24.98. It's not too bad. They're a very uh, heavy pot though, heavy ceramic. Look, I can't, I can't get over how big these leaves are. That is crazy. It's almost the size of my hand on these petonias. Uh, let's see, we got some clearance over here. Looks like just some succulents. We got some more clearance. Aglionemas, Raphidophora hay eyes. Nothing looks wrong with these. They're marked half down. Can to see what's on this cart inside here. That ginormous Halloween display. <laughs> it's a little too early for Halloween. Just a tiny bit. Oh my gosh, it's massive. Looks a little scary though. I would be scared of that guy if that was in someone's yard. Don't really see anything inside on this little cart. Kind of just more of the same. Last stop of the day. <laughs> I am gonna take a look in this Home Depot just to see. I don't know, I'm feeling lucky, you guys. I'm feeling lucky. <laughs> uh, some Syngonium. This one looks different. This doesn't look like a white butterfly. Oh. Um, it's a holly. It's a different color. It's like a minty green. It's not bad for like five or six dollars. I have lots of these alocasia polys for 15. 
couple of the golden violins left. They had these here last time. Lemon meringues, chameleon zizis. There's a couple pink princess in here too. I'm gonna see what is over this way real quick. Lots more uh, global green and uh, lemon meringue. <laughs> Got lots of them. There's another leaf joy section. Looks like pretty much the same plants. Some calathea, ficus. There's some stromanthi back there. Lots of orchids. They don't have these marked down to $10. I wonder if they forgot to put the sign up. Well, they have these fiddles marked down for $29.98. Some of them look a little sad, like that one there looks a little bit sad, but for the most part, they look okay. I feel like that's a good deal for like a fiddle leaf fig tree. $30. I feel like I never see them that big for that price. Let's see what else is back here. So many orchids. I wonder what the deal is with all the orchids. Yeah, they have these for $15.88 and they were 10 at the other one. Lots of succulents. Gosh, there's just so many plants here. Holy moly. <laughs> I'm kind of just like skipping past most of this just because it's a lot of the same stuff at the other location. Honestly, I'm just quickly scanning for certain plants. Lots more agave. Got monsteras back here. Some marble queen baskets. Gosh, snake plants. A huge, look at all these fiddles. These are all $30. That is just crazy. I was really hoping to find some small plants. I don't think they have any small plants besides that one section back there. Well, lots of hanging baskets today. Lots of marble queens and goldens. Lots more big alocasia and monstera. These guys are so big. I love them. <laughs> Some more variegated lipstick plants. I am sweating now. This was my fifth stop, well six, because I had to go to the pet store. So I am gonna call it. I am very, very hot and ready to get home in the air conditioning. So I didn't see anything in that last Home Depot. And then the only other thing that I got was the little string of dolphins and the lows. It was $7.98. I only got the one. So cute. So I got the orchid for $10. I got this ring of fire here in the plant shop. I got the dolphins 
and then I just got, so I got three plants, and then the rest are just outside. I got the agave and the philodendron. So I have a lot to unpack when I get home. So I hope you enjoyed this shopping trip, and I honestly, I can't wait for it to cool down. Um, I know the selection starts to dwindle the colder it gets, but I'm ready for fall. Thank you for coming along on this shopping trip with me. I hope you enjoyed. It was a lot of fun to just browse around. I feel like I could plant shop all day. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, I'm ready to get in the air conditioning now. If you have any questions, drop me a comment down below. Thank you so much for watching, and I will talk to you guys later.